Hello everybody, welcome in to video number 15 of Sekiro New Game Plus. Today we're going to go on the altar version of the pass where we're going to be facing three bosses. Uh, each one I have not faced before and this will be the first time I'm doing it. Uh, end goal is to get to Wolf, Sekiro's father. We're going to be facing him in an altered universe in a way and he's going to be completely different from what I understand from the first time that we fought him a few videos back. If you guys have missed any videos, make sure to go check them out. I highly recommend it. Uh, if this is your first time playing, I highly recommend going back to video number one. It'll be a little bit different since it's New Game Plus, but the guide is still there for you guys to try to face the new bosses or any bosses you want or struggling on. So, uh, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Follow, like, subscribe. We're going to get right into it. Hope you guys enjoy. Okay, to get into the alter universe you actually have to do a few steps um i did put a video up in i think it was probably video 11 or 12 i think it's 12 um of how to get to the stage so if you guys missed that please go check out video 12. Um, we had to get a certain item to be able to come here where emma is talking to our lovely friend here he's they're gonna you're gonna eavesdrop on them and you're gonna get this i don't remember exactly what it was but you're gonna get this and they're gonna be able to go here and pray and now gonna be into a different alternate um timeline um so we're gonna start off right off the bat with a boss um okay um i found a little bit of, of a guide that um helps you Pretty much kill this boss easily. So, what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna kill these boys. is I'm gonna kill I killed these guys first because I found a little bit of a, a little bit of a glitch in this this game a little bit so um, apparently this boss calls for dogs uh, but you can kind of nullify them because the dogs only stay within the fire of the building so what you want to do is pull the boss outside of this burning building and guide him to it like the first point where he starts kind of like being like oh, okay never mind he's too far you have to start walking back but what you want to do is you want to get to the other side and keep hitting him to the point where he won't attack you so let's see if i can do this here he comes we get to the point where <laughs> Glitches out. All right, so he's not attacking now. So he is at the point where he is just literally blocking and blocking and blocking. Now that we don't have these enemies here, we should get the... Oh my god, that is so easy. Let's go. We got a prayer bead. Let's go. We need one more. Okay. Wow. Wow, dude. That is that is insane easy. Easy mode. I 
so grateful that I, I took some notes before that. And there's the doggos right there. gonna have them either lose interest or I'm gonna get them into this direction. That new empowered mortal blade is so badass. Holy crap. That is so gnarly. Yeah. We got our new idol. We're gonna rest up for need one more of the prayer beads, so let's go. Got a guy here. I wonder if this might be a new train. Uh, I was gonna say this might be a new training area for like leveling, but okay. Oh wow, we have a lot of enemies here. My question is, which one, or which one? So it's not too bad. Not too bad at all. Oh, but, uh, oh no. Okay, well, I just jinxed myself here.
with these guys in here. Okay, uh, so we have that guy up there, but how do I... Oh, they're all looking at you. Um... Just like go past them, maybe. Let's go. All right, that works. That works. Okay. Um, I don't know if there's anything over there or worth it, but. Looks like we can potentially. Taking a hit up that estate was surprisingly easy. Our info was right on the money, you know. I don't like him. There's something shifty about him. The smell of a crook. Ah, <laughs> oh, he's a villain. A down and out villain, Watanabe. Well, he's useful right now. So adore him. For all his scheming, he's a nameless rogue. Shinobi, his efforts won't amount to much. Uh, ha! I'm not complaining. So long as there's. All right. I wonder if we could. Um, what was the ability that we got before that? That makes the people come closer to us. Because maybe we can make that other guy fight the boss. That's my thinking right now. I'm just trying to remember what ability we got earlier that can make people come here. Oh, whistle, whistle, whistle. Drive beast mad. Oh wow, there's a meta enemy over there as well. Hold up. I feel like... Okay, we can do that. Anything, okay, anything else before we go into this battle here? Let's see if this works. It didn't draw them, but oh man, we have these guys here now, too. Um, <laughs> let's go. Okay, let's go.
good damage, but... the jump. That's my biggest problem right now is I'm just forgetting to... I went in too early. One good thing is I have, but yeah, still... Two bosses down. Got our last. Dude, we can get that achievement now. Let's go. Let's go. Um, I'm pumped. I am also thinking Owl is going to be a pain in the butt, but. Whoa. All right, so two for two. Uh, <laughs> gotta love when you didn't. I didn't face any of those bosses. I mean, don't get me wrong. That that's just a carbon copy of uh, a different boss before. But didn't play. I didn't fight these bosses or even Owl in the first playthrough. So this is gonna be a disadvantage for me a little bit. But. Oh, it's just archers. Oh, man. Oh, okay. That dude's a little bit different. Oh, God. What is going on? is a little bit different than the other ones but um good thing is we're safe we got the the saving point and 
We're good. We're good. We're good. I think. We're good. Okay, before we go into the last boss, uh, I want to get the achievement for the prayer bee. So let's get the final um, dance and improve our posture. And hopefully, this should be 10th and the achievement. Let's go! Let's go. Upgrade vitality and posture to their limits. The final prayer bead. All right. Cool. So that's it. We cannot go any more, any further. So that's good. GG on that. And let's go. Let's get to... Go and test out this final, final boss. Um, I'm sure, I'm sure he is going to uh, kick my ass. Okay, um, I've been struggling on this fight for a little bit, um, but I found a strategy that does seem to work. It's still tricky. I recommend you guys create a, an upload file or download files so that you can keep coming back and uploading and, and having the same spot and keep practicing because the items that we're gonna use are gonna be very farce and you don't wanna, you know, go through them five times if you have no items, so. Um, I'm gonna explain the fight as we go, but my currently bar right now looks like this. Uh, you can add another one if you want to, but we're gonna be using the Defined Confetti, the Sugars, the Lumps, and we're also gonna be using uh, rice, sweet rice balls, and the Tanto. So I'm going to explain everything as we go, so um, good luck, and here we go. So, you're going to start with the Tanto, you're going to heal yourself, you're going to fight. You have time too, as long as you don't run in too far, you have a lot of time to do all this. And then finish off with the rice, don't forget about the rice. And then as soon as you get that run in, he's gonna swing, he's gonna swing, he's gonna jump. And look at that, boom. Just like that. What a fight special. Now we're gonna run off. We're gonna run off over here. And then we're gonna run up to the corner. And then we're gonna run off over here. I am going to use the rice sweet balls. And then we're gonna run off over here to the corner and then we're gonna go and use the lump. And now you want, oh, we got him in the corner. This is the perfect setup. Perfect setup, guys. This is a huge. Now you might have to do the rest of this fight. You might have to do this rest of the fight like we have to right now. So practice running away. He's almost dead. Define confetti if you can. Father Suppress. Oh. Flower 
members of the Imbros, uh, the Imbloss that bloomed in the Great Memory. Uh, we put the... Oh, this is for the ending. So this is for the actual ending. So when we beat the final, final boss, you're going to be having, in this case now, we're going to have three different endings. Um, when we get to that video, I'll show all three. Just so that everyone can see. <laughs> and we just found out too, um, previous videos, we did the first ending, but because I didn't do all the endings here, or sorry, all the bosses in the first playthrough, um, unfortunately, and this is a very big unfortunately, I actually have to play this again, again on New Game Plus 2. I have to do the first ending all over again because the game doesn't re register that I killed the, the, the Emma and Ishina or whatever his name is. So I have to actually read it. So. But either way, that is the fight. Let's go. Oh, wow. There's actually. Let's go. Uh, let's increase my strength. We got an extra little attack power. And for. Yeah. Guys, that is it for this video. Um, that strat, that, that technique took me a little while. I, I wouldn't say too long. I think it took me about a half hour of practicing to get him into that corner. I got lucky on that fight. I got him down pretty quickly in the first phase. That helped a lot. I took a lot of damage on that first mortal blade right off the bat in the second phase, and then I was able to get him to that corner. I did have to kind of swerve him in there. That's not kind of the lineup I wanted to do, but it worked. If you get him into that corner and be able to use the red lumps, and they kind of smack at him a little bit to get that bar up. And then if you need to just do a little bit at the end, just like I did, I did die, but I did, was able to run away from him again and then do the fine confetti, the lump, and the sugar. So I did use three sugars there, which is a lot, but I was able to get him. Um, big GG's on that one. Um, that video I found was huge, um, but guys, if you like what you see, hit that subscribe button, like, comment, and if you guys want to see my Twitch channel, or any of my socials. Links are down below. Thank you so much for being here. We'll see you in the next video.